I am out the heart. <laughs> That's Craig, the worker behind me. He's been here forever. I just wanted to show you before we go in. They had massive donations, <laughs> apparently. Woohoo! Can't wait till that gets processed. Okay, I'll see you guys inside. Okay, I'm in. Oh boy, did we ever have torrential rains last night. I mean, it was crazy. If you live in my area, you know what I'm talking about. We're in the foyer. So we start here. Well, now I start outside. And then I take a quick glance here because they like to decorate it. See if there's anything. Now we'll go get a cart. I have my serious thrifting kit again today. I think I showed you guys what all was in it last time. Very serious, like important things for a professional thrifter. I'm not kidding. Um, and I couldn't help it, you guys. I just spotted this, so I put it in the cart real quick. And this item here, I just went over and got it real quick, okay? Oh my gosh. I'm not sure about this one though, $8.99. <laughs> I want and that one's wooden, so yes. Only two ninety nine. So twenty four ninety nine. Sure would hate to miss out on an authentic Pollock, if I'm saying it right. But it is a Stewart. It's upside down, but it's a Stewart. <laughs> I think it says $24.99. <laughs> it's a big one too. Oh, I wish I didn't see that. <laughs> it's a swan. It's a glass swan. I do not need any more white swan Christmas, but look how cute it is. Whew, okay, they're done with the vacuum cleaner. Let me check this, that color. Hmm, that color, right? Oh, those are salt and pepper shakers. Let me pull those out. I'll back up for you guys for a second while I pull these out. Let's see how much they are. $3.99. Let's check those out. Everything is half price except for, well, pink. You know, the stuff I'm grabbing. <laughs> oh, hold on. Oh my gosh. Is that... That is a bag full of plastic. Like, you can't see it because they're like white opaque. There's like 15 little deer in there. Are you kidding me? I love the little kitschy deers. Yes, we're gonna get that. Some I'll display in my deer collection at Christmas and some will be for assemblages. Assemblages, excuse me. <laughs> What are these? Little angels. No, little cupids. That wouldn't be bad either. And I see some wooden objects. Huge elephant. Those are half price. Looks like there's four of them. That one's got the tusk. Let me see. Mike, it's probably some broken tusk in here, yeah. Darn. So the buzzing is not here any longer, as Sitting Kitty told me. What? Wait a minute. What? 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 <laughs> We're just looking. I'm not getting this. It's only $3.99. <laughs> the paint job, though, is not quite there, but what the heck? You are kind of cute. You get two cutes. Two of my cute quotas. Yes, you do. This thing is still here. I'm pretty sure it's a Mikasa. So we've already dealt with that. Wait a minute, what is that? Okay, I see something back. <laughs> 249, those are cool. Made in Italy. Darn it. Cracked though. There's four of them. Made in Italy. Okay, stay on track. So vacuuming though she was vacuuming the foyer so and I can't just stand here you guys and wait I, I'm in the middle of a thrift store all right now the caps make me think yes somewhat vintage but I'm not sold so I'm gonna double check these for 
I want to get this little metal thing for an assemblage as well. And a lot of you seem to like these. That's only $2.49. That's a cute one. And that one does have glass beads, it looks like. So I'm happy with that. Another little thing off the rounder. $3. But what I want is that. The little skunk with the bucket. Let's see. The other one is a Russ. The angel with the dove. And let's try this dude. Mounted on wood, $4.99. Little metal fisherman. Let's see, did I add anything else? Come around real quick. Yeah, because she brought out a cart. Hangers, those velvet hangers. That's a pack of like 10 for $1.99. Unfortunately, here there's only three. They're $1.99. Let me show you the other two, but these are signed. Yeah, these have a etch signature. So even though there's only three, I'm gonna get those. Guess what? <laughs> Mug life. Actually, I already took a peek, you guys, and I didn't see anything. Let me see. If, wait a minute. That does not have the twin towers on it. Okay. I didn't see anything, but that little wooden plaque that said mug life which made me giggle and one other thing that was cute of oh, this current mood add to cart <laughs> that's funny there's another acrylic piece that's half price it's a skier that's good for this area See what was hiding back here that I didn't notice when we were on the other side. <laughs> okay. That's a nice little candle holder. I'm not sure how old it is. It's awful bright. It's not painted. It's only be a dollar fifty. It's kind of cool. This was a mud pie, something or other. But <laughs> all we get is a box. If it was a little cheaper, I would do it. It's molded to whatever was supposed to go in there, but still something would fit in there, like a paperweight or something for shipping. They are really bringing out the new stuff too. This one worker, she's somewhat new. She's like quick. That's a diffuser. I thought it was glass. It's a diffuser. Plastic. <laughs> oh my gosh. Now, I don't love, love this, but that right there, like, I see people like Jocelyn, Crazy Lamp Lady for one, a couple other people pick up like bird pictures like this. Sometimes they're Japan, sometimes they're Czech. I wonder what this is. It's probably Japan. It's just the it's just that bird I like on there. See I just don't this style just doesn't really trend that well. But it's that bird. Okay, how much was it again? Six ninety nine. Okay. If it's here next sale day, then yes. Before we start this aisle another few things off the cart that's interesting isn't it wood it's like a little grinder that looks kind of vintagey huh $2.99 I don't normally do this unless they're super epic now I don't know if these are super epic but they're kind of epic and they are half price so I'm gonna do those two of them Okay, we'll get started in this aisle. <laughs> oh, I love that. It's broken, but let me see. Nope, not a gym shore. Uh-oh, uh-oh, what are you? $2.99 half price. That has to go in the cart. 
just a second ago I saw something in Cornwall. Oh, yeah. I've got a few polar bear things too. Oh, it says Alaska though. Canada. $50. Yay. Big old sailboat. Um, that is Avon. I am sticking to the critters. Let's see what they got down here. Wow. That was a Viking boat. Becky's not doing Avon. You guys, you know I'm just doing the critters. Avon doesn't resell for much. But you know what? This though. I feel like I should get this Viking Discover. Um, I'm going to get this though for Becky. Vintage Viking treasures. So guess what Becky? You now have a gratuitous piece of Avon. <laughs> And since a friend gave it to you, you kind of got to keep it, right? Okay, I already got the rhino. Either Becky or Ruby or Heidi up in Denver got me that. <laughs> Cell phones. They're fun to look at, though. Dang. Oh, no, it's a calculator. Okay. Back away from the Avon before you get carried away. This isn't the best quality of glass at all. $12.99 be $6.50. I know it's pretty, you guys, but up close it is not that great. <laughs> More Avon paid. $5.99. Ah, okay, stop Avon. That's Avon again. And there's another Avon. Um, it's just fun stuff. To me, that's like. 80s, 70s, 80s, 90s kits, right? So I think as it all ends up at the thrift store, nobody buys it and it gets into the landfills like wasted. I think about 10 years from now, some of the more epic pieces will then be rare. And guess what? I'll have most of the critters. <laughs> oh, I need you. $1.99. Yes, I want you for my. I want you for my little, oh darn, you're broken. We're at blankets and such. I sort of like this. I mean, it's not really quilted, it's just quilted fabric. <laughs> not real crazy about the little pink yarn. But I did find one. Oh, and by the way, this is only $3.99. It's not worth that much more, maybe what, 15 ish give or take. I do like the bird on it for this tonala or tonala, however you want to say it. So I'll get that to bring to a sale for you guys. That's cute. If nobody wants it, I'll put it in the booth. Okay, so I one crochet afghan. Uh, okay, honestly, I'm not loving the colors, but that might match some kind of sports team or something, or somebody might like it. It's a concentric square and it is half price, $3.50. So I think I'm saying concentric square the right way, meaning it just gets smaller, smaller, smaller to the middle. And it's a pretty decent size. <laughs> so we definitely will keep an eye out for anything Barbie. I, I started buying the Barbie stuff, like I told you guys, kind of epic Barbie stuff months ago when I got hurt the rumor online um, and then of course Pee Wee Herman passed away I've got some Pee Wee Herman stuff oh my gosh I, that I've been it's from Dallas so it's already 20 some years old just from me having it I've got one of the dolls and a few other things because I was a fan and you know when he had the incident and they couldn't, he couldn't do Pee Wee Herman character anymore because, you know, the incident. <laughs> oh my gosh. Um, but he did go on to do some other amazing roles. Some bad guys, that, like awesome. Okay, why am I lingering on this? It's not on sale. Pretty baby colors though. Hmm. Hi, hi. So at the last one, I got to talking to somebody and, um, <laughs> stopped filming. I can only I can multitask two things, but not quite three. 
anyways that's cool because I just zipped down a few blocks to the next one it's you know another sale day so I'm gonna hit a couple of them so I'll see you inside this one all right here we go so again it's the same day I just zipped down the street so I could add to this since you guys didn't catch the last few minutes of the other location oh my gosh that's so cute little hobbyist piece $2.99 so every color but pink of course that's the color that's coming out I did put this is that spray painted yeah those are gun shells right I think somebody made this and spray painted it let me show you up close I might get that that looks like something I don't know, not to be sexist, but something like a guy would like. Holy moly, what is that? That's, let's hope this is a good price. I see a chip though, $16.99. I think I see a chip, yep. $16.99 with a chip, come on now. That's sad though. <laughs> I'm looking for Barbie pink stuff. I might show them that chip and see maybe they might help me out a little bit with the price on that all right oh boy that's pretty okay I'm I was gonna say I really never know if something's missing that's like a hummingbird feeder or something I don't know but it's signed too what a bummer you can't see it probably but it's signed and dated but it sure does have a big chip in it all right I'm gonna put it back <laughs> I have quite a few Statue of Liberties part of my branding and I I don't know I there's something about it I like so I have quite a few little ones around my house I see some Avon made it to this location as well I need to check what these are made out of. Made in China. Okay, I think they're just resin. That's a bit much. Five dollars. What is this thing? Oh, it's some kind of optic. Magnifying optic. That probably should not be sitting too close to the window here. I don't know. Huh. <laughs> Cutie pie chipped. I like you. Oh, you are the tiniest little petite little dish. Look at you, 69 cents. It doesn't have a chip either. Hang on, you guys. Here, look at something else for a moment. Okay. No, it doesn't have a chip. For some reason, I don't know why, I want to get this. I want to do some little assemblage type things this year, closer to the holidays. That's only 69 cents too. I wish it was done a little better. Bunch of little petites. Pixie with attitude. <laughs> See, we were just here last week, but you know, they're, they stock all the time. So we will see some things, you know, that no one wanted. Um, but, you know, there'll be some new things too. Rosenthal. Okay, we need to open that up. That might be... A Wimblad design or something in there. Oh my goodness. Little tiny. Oh, I know what those are. They go like this. Those are those little like vampire glasses. I, you guys probably can't see, but it sits like this. All right, hang on. So it sits like this. It's got two feet. And then this here that looks like a tail is the straw. And typically they're called vampire. I think I'm going to get those. That's a nice set. Brand new. Boxed. I'm going to get those for the booth. Rosenthal. 
person. Oh, that's a nice, that's not bad for that kind of Sirocco type. Yes, Sirocco, $4.99. That's actually kind of a pretty one, isn't it? You'd have to touch it up. I'm gonna leave it here. This is commercial. I just like the mid-century mod vibes on it. I sure wish that was an artisan piece. I still might get it. I just like the vibes on it. It's only $1.99. Nice little inexpensive booth piece, okay? I'm remembering to back up now and then. This is actually ceramic. Looks kind of 80s. Probably newer than that even. Sweet. Okay, let me pause here for a moment. Wait a minute, is that a cat? That is an Avon. That is an Avon critter. There's a cat in there. Kind of 80s style. Oh my goodness. It's not glass. For super fun, I'm putting that into the cat sale. Let me come in close. See, it's a little stuffed animal cat. New old stock. Gift collection. So it might have been somewhat limited edition. All right, let's open this box up. All right, it is another plaque. Fish, cat, couple of people. Yeah, Bjorn Windbald or Windblad. I'll have to check the price though. Wait a minute. Studio line, calendar, and clothes below. Made in Germany. I think it says 79 to 80. I might check prices on this. It, sometimes it can be good, but something kind of like a, just a wall plaque. It's not like a big ceramic piece. Not always quite so much. It's a magnet. I thought it was another little pottery piece. I mean it is pottery but it's a magnet. Avon, Victorian Luxuries. Oh look at this. Alco Industries. Made in China. I'm also going to add this. That's pretty cute. It's an Earth Tones. I just want to put it in the booth. That's a pit bull, right? I'm not a fan of pit bulls, but I have known a couple that weren't too bad. It looks like Avon as well. Yes, it is. Sweet little dish. <laughs> bells, bells. Those have been upcycled. All right, let's see. <laughs> Carved out of some kind of a gourd. Might be Raku. No, not quite. Uh, no. It could have been. It was cracked though, so I don't have to spend too much time. This is very modern, but it's glass, you guys. Probably lights up, huh? It's got a broken wing. Customize family member names. Oh my goodness. That's cute. You could paint it up. It's um, plastic. None of these are that old. 
This one, made in Japan. I think that's probably the oldest one right there. I'm not a big buyer of the colonial type stuff. Music's fairly low, so I don't have to keep chitter chattering with you guys. <laughs> I don't really know what to say. That could be forthcoming though. This has been somewhat of a rough week for me. Behind the scenes or offline, I've been a little crunchy. I'm leaning toward crispy actually. <laughs> Seriously. So, just nothing in particular. Just a lot of medium sized things. But when you get a lot of them at once, sometimes it's like, whoa, right? Wait a minute, this one might be, I missed that. That one is made in Japan too. How much are these? $1.50? It's just not that much of my jam. Let me see what this says. Love always. Let's see if there's any, I don't think it's quality enough for Baccarat. <laughs> I don't even know if I said that right, but you guys know what I'm talking about. Oh, I sure would like to see those. It's kind of like the one we just looked at, but look at those pink swans. Maybe they'll turn up. Or this is probably the box. Oh, I see. Yeah, I can see there's a different. Okay, that's probably the box for that. Okay, you guys. You, this might seriously make you laugh like it did me. Look. <laughs> 2002. I almost feel like I want to add this to the Critter Collection. And it's half price. I'm going to. Okay. But just Critters. Okay. I'm really trying. But I think that would be cool. Oh, there's some artisan pottery. I'm going to look up that name. We're going to put that in the cart. We're going to look at that name up. Nice and legible. <laughs> I like that. I've got some interesting people coming over. I'm going to surprise you guys again for August. That would be a great thank you gift for one of them. <laughs> You guys are going to have fun with who's coming over. Wait a minute. Now this is something different. Oh darn, I wish she wasn't broken. These little things right here, the dolls and stuff. That's a different story even though it's somewhat new. There's another tile. That would make a good mid-century mod. I'm gonna get that too. Somebody said, are you still, um, like, why haven't we seen your booth, you guys? Oh my gosh. I haven't, because of everything that's kind of going on behind the scenes, I don't talk about too much when we're, you know, live, because y'all don't want to hear all that. Like, if you're like me, YouTube and stuff is for fun. Let me stop for a minute. I think I want to get this little petite too. Look at that drip glaze on that. That's a little chip. I'm still getting this. There's something about this. I forget what I was babbling about. Um, oh, my booth, yeah. So, it's, I just haven't gotten there. And seriously, sales really showed it too. I'm gonna get these for my house these little steppers um, but I've I'm working on it I've got five or six bins already oh that's cute that's kind of cool let's see what's inside let's check this inside it's just a box kind of newish but that's interesting I I remember when I was doing a lot of spiritual studies, I took a couple years off and I lived out in Manitou Springs. And 
I read every self-help book in the library. The internet was still dial-up, okay? We had one computer, it was dial-up, AOL, or, yeah, was it AOL? Net zero, probably. So we utilized the library, too. And, uh, you know, kind of did a thing. I've only told a few people, became an ordained minister. Yes, <laughs> feel free to call me Reb if you want. <laughs> No, I'm totally kidding. Don't do that. Anyways, um, one of my favorite sayings was, uh, what would you do if you weren't afraid? I remember the, there was this really fun guy that would walk around and give you that card that said that. And that's all it said. I think he had some kind of like little church he was starting, but no pressure. He would just give you that card and it was interesting enough to make you, you know, want to stop and talk to him. We looked at that last time, didn't we? Okay, it's cracked. No, I'm not even looking at that. Stop with the Avon. That's enough. <laughs> you bought a piece for, an awesome piece though, for Becky, and an oddball for yourself. Okay, I flipped the aisles. I'm sharing it with somebody, okay? So I'll just show you what I have just in this two-foot section. That's all I did. Another vampire little, I guess at that size, shot glass, I don't know, cordial set. Those are cool. Saw this little kitty. I don't know anything about it, but it's half price, so we'll do that. Oh, Tiffany style. Put a, a tea light in it. $6.99 doesn't seem like a bad price though. Party light, that's what I thought. Party light. I should probably get that. Well, I bet you that's got a little bit of room left. There's actually two of them. Let's see if this is party light too. Yes. I have to watch the ratio of new stuff that I put in my booth. I'm gonna let someone else have fun with that. I'm back. Here are some verdicts. This Ham Sun, not Hampton, 1983. Couldn't really find anything. Uh, does have 80 vibes. 80s vibe. I'm gonna go ahead and leave it for $6.99. I, it might be worth a little more, but, and I did look at this, and I'm gonna decide against it. It's only $2.99 though. Pretty sure it's just a piece of Chinese glass. If it was a little more, it is amethyst glass, but you could barely see through it. Now, if it was a little bit more, you know, purpley where you could see through it, definitely, because it's only $2.99. Just sell it for like, I don't know. 12 or something at the booth and the verdict on this this is part of a series the four winds this is north and I'm not gonna say they sell fast and furious there's plenty for sale like on eBay how much is this $7.99 I think I'll put it back to they sell for somewhere around 25 to 30 but there's like eight or nine listed and one sold recently so <laughs> let's be a little bit more smart about it and we'll just set this here all right that's just that's cheap nothing oh and this the verdict on this i'll pop up a picture it's cute but this is straight out of alibaba for like a couple of bucks something about me still wants to get it I just think it's so cute to do some kind of little upcycle I'm um, so I am and I'm gonna take a chance while I paused here in this quiet corner here back by books in the window I went ahead and looked through these it's gonna be a dollar <laughs> okay you guys <laughs> okay it's only gonna be a dollar because it's half rice it's some old school I think 80s 90s like computer software things like that pens and 
it'll be long tail until it finds the right person but it's just a seri serious variety but somebody's gonna come along and be like oh my gosh yeah some IT person's gonna be like what okay so I'm just gonna go for it if I'm wrong I'm wrong it's only a dollar I want to have fun with that I like to have unique and I won't say weird but you know the more unique stuff I'm gonna get away from this dinger, huh? 2005. Woo, Mel's all up in the news. Oh, so Jamie Foxx, right? Good stuff, good stuff. Mel recovered from his little faux pas, and he and a bunch of other people, Brad Pitt, I mean, they are bringing Oprah down. Okay, I gotta take a deep breath. <laughs> My goodness. <laughs> All right, so there are, this is half price, so it'll be $3. Code two, two, code two, um, about two, five two. sets of horse salt and pepper shakers. Now this isn't a whole lot of money, but serving pieces do better, and it's in good shape. It's a Pyrex. It's a little bit more vintage. It is laurel leaf. So for $3.99, I think it's worth about I don't know. I've seen prices sold, depending on what platform, anywhere from $15 to $38. But because it's a little serving dish and in great shape, I'll get that. How fun is that? $1.99. That looks like a real one in there, too. $19.68. So get that. But wait for it. Like, I can go home happy with what I have so far. Look. Relpo. Made in Japan, half price, one dollar. <laughs> That's not Mr. Toodles. That's somebody else, but still a dollar. Great shape. Hey, I'm super happy already, but I'm gonna hang out and do a few more aisles. Ready for it? I'm having such luck today. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> Knee-high Converse. Oh my gosh, I've always wanted a pair, but I didn't want to pay the price. Of course, um, the 80s, 90s shoelaces have to come out, but they are my size and they are $12.99, so yay! <laughs> Love it! Hey, have you guys ever seen this? I've seen a couple of these, they're cool. Where you take a book, an older book, and make like a little purse or bag out of it. How much is that one? $7.99? Gulliver's Travels. Cute. Okay, yes, giggles, giggles. Finally found one of these at an affordable price with nice smooth drawers and wheels. Nine dollars. I need to organize my jewelry. So, yes. And nice brand new, half price, little Barbie pink top since that's going to be trending. I already have a couple though. Like I said, I started buying them a while back. Let me run through these purses again. I'd rather finish. I paused when I saw that one to talk to you guys. Nothing else looks that great. I don't even think I see any real leather. Pretty colors, but... Well, I made another quick sweep through hard goods because while I was in the back, other side, you know, they were still putting stuff out. I think that's, it's cute, but I know that's modern, yeah. $3.99 too, made in China. The only thing I added, let me turn slowly, just for fun, 35 cents from Big Lots. But these are, I think these are hilarious for some reason. I don't know why I think these are hilarious and I might need them for something. <laughs> Okay, that's still daylight, and I might grab something to eat and go hit one more on the way home. So, I hope you guys had a little bit of fun with these two arcs, and I will talk to you later.